you think that uh, rules are made to be broken, though, in some respects, in terms of maybe even just fiction? Yeah. Uh, oh, yeah, yeah. Rules are always made to be broken. You know, one of the things I had started out actually as a music education major in college. And one of the things that they do, um, you know, obviously, I switched into English Lit, but one of the things they do is they take you through all the music theory stuff. And then at the end, they say, now, forget it. Don't worry about it. It doesn't matter. Write whatever you want, <laughs> you know. And so you have to, of course, you know the rules, but that doesn't mean you have to actually go by them, you know. And, and that's, that's a good thing. That's how we come up with original storylines. That's how we get such unique characters that go far outside of, you know, what we saw in like 20s writing or, or 30s writing or something. So, I mean, just go with what you think and then see how it all flows, how it all works. And that's really what's going to determine it, not a set of rules, in my opinion. Yeah, my favorite rule to break is the one sentence paragraph. That, to me, I love making those. If yeah, I, yeah. I, I like to do that from time to time. But. They can be very impactful if you use them right. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. Our friend Jason Greenside did a one one word chapter, which I thought was which was ingenious in his book as well. Yeah, it's literary and it says something. It's not just a random nothing, you know, just to be yeah. different. It, it was on purpose, you know. So, so breaking in, in break in the spirit of breaking rules, you want to do it to have an impact. You don't want to do it just to do it. Exactly. If you're doing it just to do it, people can tell that too. And that's when you start getting the comments, you know, all the reviews saying, oh, this person was either trying too hard or, you know, the point didn't get across or something like that, you know. And I've seen that, actually, I've seen that criticism a lot about YA books when it came really into fashion to put like one word on each line, like yeah. just because it was in fashion, not because it meant anything. So yeah. like, that's something to be careful of. Really do what is best for your book. That's, that's it. That's it. <laughs>